Just give me a reason to keep my heart beating Don't worry, it's safe right here in my arms As the world falls apart around us All we can do is hold on What is up guys, DT Ninja here to bring you my Boruto, Naruto Next Generations live reaction. Yes guys, this is uh, the new series about Boruto specifically and I managed to avoid most of the spoilers so I don't know really what goes down. All I know is something big happens in this chapter and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, yeah, let's get into it. Alright, so the very beginning shows the Hokage Mountain. A pair of warriors face off on the destroyed faces of the Hokage. Wait, the destroyed faces of the Hokage? Whoa. Whoa, that's some intense. That's intense. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. So we're we're getting right into the the seriousness of this of this series wow okay to think that you'd be this strong Kawaki yo yo holy hell yo Boruto looks yo he looks awesome I love his look he's got like this cape and he's you know he's all cut up it looks like he's been in battle he's got these uh, scar. I don't know if they're scars or they're symbols or you know um, something is on his arm. You know, it looks like a, some kind of symbol on his arm. Kawaki. Wow, this is the the villain. This is the villain's name. I'll be sending you to meet the seventh. Wait, I'll be sending you to meet the seventh. Is he implying that? He defeated Naruto? And he's gone? What? No. No. No, that can't be it. I'll be sending you to meet the seventh, Boruto. Holy hell. He means that Naruto is gone. He says Naruto is gone. What? What? Oh my god, there's no way. Yo, this can't this can't be true. Alright, well I'm not gonna believe uh it right away because this is the first page of the entire series. But wow, what an entrance. Wow, okay. That was not what I was expecting. Okay, so the first color page uh was Wow, spectacular. You know, we got an older Boruto. Like, he's old. Like, almost, like, teenage. Like, 15, 16 uh, years old. So, wow. He looks that old. Okay, and then, now we got Kawaki's first uh, scan here. We got Sasuke. Sasuke's not, not the best scan. Inogen, not really liking his scan either. Wow. Wow, wow. I'm liking Cho Chocho looks nice. Chocho looks Chocho looks cute actually. Um and then we got uh Shikadai. And then it looks like Moegi? Moegi, yeah that's Moegi. Definitely Moegi. Um from Konohamaru's uh friend, you know, team. Uh who worked uh, with Naruto. Okay, and then you got the Hokage, obviously, with Naruto, and then Boruto in the front, and then his team in on the sides with Mitsuki and Sadada. Sadada looks nice. So, yeah, that's a really awesome color page. Alright. Okay, so Boruto is shown here, and he's holding the sword, and his one eye is closed, and he's got a cut on it, and he looks similar to Kakashi there, and he's all bloodied up he's all bruised and you know he really looks like a warrior there and so he says these words he says did things really have to turn out like this so what he means is 
it's almost like Konoha's destroyed. You can see it in the bottom here. And Kawaki says, yes. And he shows him his arm. He shows him his, his arm here. And he's got like these markings on his arm. And then we see the age. He says the age of the ninja is over. And you see all of the Hokage statues, all of the mountain is completely destroyed. It's all destroyed. And the Konoha village is also in ruins. So this is what he means. You know, did it have to turn out like this? And so that also implies that Naruto and Sasuke were defeated. It, it implies that. But are they dead? I, I don't think they're dead. But um, if you want to believe that, you can. Um, but I personally don't think Naruto is dead. And I, I think they're defeated. They were defeated by him. But I, I truly, I don't think Naruto is dead. And I refuse to believe that. And... My tale begins as I began rebelling against my father for not paying me enough attention. Hinata's face looks nice, but I don't know, her chest, you know, she looks rather flat. That's just me. Um, teach you some manners, you dumbass panda. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember this. Okay. Uh, it's nothing. Come on. That's a weak-ass panda. Pandas fall under the classification of bears, you dimwit. I think we have more pressing matters at hand. Our top priority should be subduing this bear panda and returning him to Konohamaru Sensei's place. So we see the bear. And Boruto knocks him out, right? Using Kagamu Shin no Jutsu. Alright, told you a weak ass one. As expected of the seventh Hokage's son and the fourth Hokage's grandson, it seems Boruto is destined to become Hokage after all. And Zarada's like, Hokage ni Naru, Watashi o? I'm the one who will become Hokage. So. <laughs> It's like a apparatus on the wrist. And he uses Kage Shibari no Jutsu, which is the shadow binding Jutsu, to take him out. Wow, so cool! This new ninja apparatus. Yeah, see? Ninja tools can be sealed within the scroll. The one you just saw was Shikamaru's shadow binding Jutsu. Now, using my Rasengan. You'll be able to fire it. So he seals it inside and he loads it and boom! World to movie. We're seeing Inoshikujo's, Inoshikujo's uh, side of the story. So, so Moegi's giving the application for the tuning exams. Um, I'm loving Chocho's design. Now, Inojin, I'm, I'm, I'm on the fence, you know. He looks okay, but he doesn't look like the genius that Kishimoto made him to look like. So, I don't know. I'd have to get used to this, this Inogen, but I don't like his design. I like Chocho's. Shikadai's alright. I like Chocho's design. It's really good. Um, and Moegi's really good, too. Mo he does Moegi, and so it seems like he does girls really well, uh, especially Chocho and Moegi. What a pain... But we're still rookies. I don't know if... He's right, Moegi-sensei. We wouldn't stand a chance, you know. That must be Chocho talking. Hey, fat ass, are you even listening? The tuning exam's application. Lo loud and clear. Something about chewing exact communication, right? <laughs> chewing. Chewing. Of course. One track mind, right? That's awesome. Did you chew off those ears of yours, too? Okay, at least he's keeping, you know, their characters the same, even if they're not drawn the same. Yawn. And then she's like, Ugh. They have the physical capabilities, but mentally and emotionally? Uh, I don't think so. Time to use these. Here. Letters. I received them from Tamari-san and Ino-san. 
mother, mother, but told me, they told me to hand them over to you if you started getting cold feet about the exam. So In Inojin and Shikadai are looking at, at the, the letters and they're like, they're like, oh my god, what did mom, like, mom made like an ultimatum or something. What's up? We gotta do your best in the exam, you know, Gene. Yeah, you're right. So they're all sweating. So apparently they they made uh, an ultimatum. They must participate in the exam. Oh yeah, we're supposed to meet up with Boruto today. Damn, almost forgot. Catch you later, Sensei. We'll fill out the applications and send them in. What got into them all of a sudden? Those must have been some persuasive letters. Assistance, we cannot participate. Yeah, so? And Sadada grabs him. My dream is to become Hokage. If you stand in the way of that, so help me God. Hokage, tell that to someone who actually cares. Since you brought up your parents, who are they anyway? Oh, that's Big Bro. Guess whose birthday it is today? Let's go home and party. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I gotta go. See ya. It's not often Boruto makes expression like that. Hmm, you're right. He drops the cake. A shadow clone. That son of a... Boruto. Hold it right there, Boruto. What do you want? Your father, he just puts... The village's needs before his own. He's not neglecting the two of you. On purpose, understand? No, I don't understand. Why is dad even the Hokage? We might be dinosaurs, huh? The true nature of a ninja never changes, no matter how the tides may shift. Ouch! You're pretty cool. Hey, you were my dad's rival, right? I see. Brand new, huh? Please, let me... Let me be your disciple. There's someone I have to defeat at, at any and all costs. Actually, Sasuke looks pretty cool there. And that's the end of the chapter, guys. Okay. So this is the this is my live reaction, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, for the most part, uh, it was... It was a lot of the movie, the Boruto movie, but it makes sense. He's he's reflecting on this time because this is what changed him, you know, to kind of respect his father. So it would make sense that they put this in, in the, the manga. But I can also see why some people are going to hate this chapter because they already saw the movie and they want something new. But anyways... I hope you guys enjoyed my live reaction, and there will be a review coming. So, yeah, 